You were quoted in the Detroit Free Press this morning uh, as saying that, you know, the key is to connect the dots and maybe the Obama administration will now realize that. Is it really fair to hold the Obama administration responsible here? Yeah, I think it really is because I think the, the connecting the dots here is not necessarily on this particular case. It's connecting the dots that we've seen over the last 11 months, over the last eight years. What do we have here? This is a international movement of radicalization. All right. The Obama administration came in and said, we're not going to use the word terrorism anymore. We're going to call it man-made disasters, trying to, you know, I think, downplay the threat from terrorism. In reality, it's getting much more complex. Radicalization <clears throat> is alive. It is well. They want to attack the United States. That threat is here in the United States. It is lone wolf individuals. It is people that have become radicalized, that have had some contact with Al Qaeda. And then it is the threat that comes from Al Qaeda Central. Homegrown terrorism, the threat to the United States is real. I think this administration has downplayed it. They need to recognize it, identify it. It is the only way we are going to defeat it.